Let's start with the fourth one. It says B, E and Z have our two equal altitudes of triangle A, B, C. Using RHS congruency rule, prove that triangle A, B, C is an isosceles triangle. So, to prove map ka kya aega? that we have to prove A, B is equal to A, C. Or given kya aapka ki B, E or C, F, they are equal. Or B, E or C, F ka banenge aamare, they are the altitudes. So, ye ho gaya aapka B, E. Or is side pe aapka ho gaya C, F. ठीक है अब इसके बाद हमें प्रूफ क्या करना है दैट ए बी इज इक्वल टू ए सी तो कौन से दो ट्रायंगल्स लिए जाएंगे इस केस में कि हम प्रूफ कर सके कि हमारा ए बी और ए सी इक्वल है तो ए बी और ए सी इक्वल करने के लिए हमें क्या करना पड़ेगा आई हैव टू टेक टू ट्रायंगल्स सो दैट आई कैन मेक एंगल्स कॉमन तो लेट्स सी व्हिच टू ट्रायंगल्स आई कैन टेक सो इन दिस आई वुड बी टेकिंग राइट एंगल ट्रायंगल BEC and I would be taking CF B. So, we know that BE CF is equal to the same. What you will write is given. Common is the same. The base is common. It is BC. So, BC is equal to BC. Common. Okay. The third thing is that you will write here. It would be a 90 degree angle. 90 degree angle is the same. BFC is equal to angle B E C 90 degree होगा ठीक है अब ये हमारा ये 90 each है तो हमारा triangle किसके congruent हो गया B E C वाला it is congruent to C F B by which congruency R H S because this is my right angle this is your hypotenuse B C is hypotenuse and this is one of the side R H S so, RHS congruency is equal with you. So, I can say that this angle, angle B, would be equal to angle C. And we know that the sides opposite are opposite, ang opposite angle. Ke, they are always equal. So, my AB, AC is equal. Ho Why? We will write sides opposite to equal angles are equal. So yes, my triangle ABC is an isosceles triangle. So this is your answer for the fourth one. Now moving to fifth question.